Hello everyone. Today let's have a look at how to edit PDF files in our Google Drive uh, with the free version of Adobe Acrobat. So let's open our drive. Here I've already pre-uploaded a PDF file, a PDF worksheet. So I'm just going to right click mouse, open with and choose Adobe. So Adobe is not installed. So I'm going to click on connect more apps. So that will prompt this uh, dialog box, which means uh, you are in Google Workspace Marketplace, kind of a Google uh, uh, store. So click and type for the word Adobe. The first displayed here, Adobe Acrobat, click on it and click install. Give permission to Adobe and choose your email and click on all uh, click on all the boxes to give permission okay that's it and then you will have an option to make it default app or you can just untick it if you don't want to so i'm just keeping yeah okay and move on so untick okay there you are okay let's check if adobe is installed right click mouse open with as you can see, Adobe Acrobat for Google Drive is installed and is ready to be used. So all you need to do is just double click on it, on the PDF, and that will open your... So I'm just going to use my email to move on. So the next time you're going to open, you will not prompt you anymore. Okay, you have an option to take a tour or skip. So I'm just going to skip. You may as well move on with the tour. Okay. And here I have my worksheet, which I need to edit. So here, name, date, and work on. Okay, I'm going to choose a text box to type the, my name. So online, learning. Okay, and here the date, which is 14 November. It's today's date, right? Okay, there you are. I've already, uh, and uh, if I need to move the box, the text box, I just have to click on it and just drag it around there and position it and then you can just click on it to change the type uh, or the font size i'm just increasing the font size to 18 and that's it and here the same thing i'm just coming back wait for their uh, uh, cursors to prompt you the arrow and then you can choose the font size keeping it 18 and that's it and then you have also an option for the color you can choose a color for your letter uh, font, font color actually. So I'm gonna keep it black for easy. And this part here, the comment box, you just close it. Okay, divide by three. I'm gonna solve this worksheet by uh, division worksheet. So I'm gonna choose a drawing tool, pencil, to group this three divided by three. So I'm gonna put three in a group of together, right? Three divided by three gives me a group of one. So I'm just, just writing it. 6 divided by 3, that will also be another, form them into groups of 3. So how many groups? 1, 2. So there are 2 groups of 3. And the next one, are 9 strawberries divided into 3. So 3, 3, another 3, and that's it. So I have 3. Right, so there you are. You have a choice of writing it with the drawing tool, or you can use a text box to fill in the answer there. Um, it's your own um, way how you want to do it. All right, it's your free will, uh, own choice. Okay, now once you're done, once you're done with the, well, I'm just gonna undo it. Okay, redo. Yeah, I'm just gonna click save, and that will save in your Google Drive. Okay, so once you're done, you're done. Or you can also download this PDF once you're done uh, to save it a save a copy in your desktop. Okay, so now I'm done with this uh, worksheet. I'm already completed, but I'm gonna continue next time. So as you can see, my PDF file remains in my drive. Just try opening it again to see the status of it. All right, Adobe is opening it now. That's the worksheet I was working on. As you can see, it has, it has saved all the last work I've done. So you can just continue from there and save it again if you want to. Yeah, that's it. That's a very simple 
basic uh, way how to use Adobe to edit your PDF file. Thank you for watching.